A college degree is getting more expensive every year, and that degree no longer promises a high-paying job, meaning that students can now spend decades paying off their student loans. That's why you may be interested in this, good-paying jobs that don't require a degree. We've all heard the horror stories of huge college debts and few jobs upon graduation. So Cindy Wetland and Erica Coleman instead decided to study nursing at a technical college, Cincinnati State. Compared to other, some of the other community colleges and the other colleges, it's a huge, huge difference. It's thousands of dollars. So it's kind of like a preliminary or beginning course. Community colleges and trade schools may not have the prestige of a university, but for a fraction of the cost, they're turning out graduates who are finding good jobs. There's great jobs that don't require a four-year degree. Harry Snyder is workforce development director at a vocational school that many college-bound kids don't even consider. Great Oaks. He says they should because there's lots of demand for these students. Last week we had some welders that just started work and they were making $23 an hour right out, right out of school. That's $46,000 a year. Harry walked me through the diesel engine repair classroom, a field where companies are paying top dollar. $40,000 a year. Um, again, without overtime, you get into overtime and you can make $50,000, $60,000 a year. $60,000 a year, no college degree. You need just a year of school for less than nine grand. Diesel too messy? How about air conditioning? Those are great jobs right now, and, and they're, looking, they're looking for technicians as we speak. Average starting salary, 35 k and you can work up to 50 grand in a few years. CNN lists a number of $50,000 jobs that don't need a degree. In addition to heating, air conditioning, and diesel maintenance, it includes dental hygiene, nursing, radiation therapy, police, firefighting, and EMT work, truck driving, elevator repair, auto body repair, and air traffic control. Victor Sokol and Ashley Pence are studying to be EMTs. Uh, it's a lot cheaper than going to a four-year college. A thrill to be able to help others and not have huge college debt. 